Hi friends, in this video, we are going to check how to flash a custom ROM in this Redmi Wins Redmi 5 Plus device. This is running on now got currently it is running on MIUI 11.2. The Android version is uh, 8. You can see this is now got version. So I am going to upgrade this one to latest Android 13. So how to flash the latest ROM in this device? The main advantage for flashing a custom ROM is we can use the latest versions of all applications with this Android 13 version. Otherwise, this device is not going to support old versions of some applications. So, let's check how to flash a custom ROM. So, first of all, you go to this MIUI version and press here for 10 times. Then, you will get a message like this. You are now a developer. You have to go to the developer option. Here it is, additional settings, then developer options. So this option is enabled, then go down, then there is an option USB debugging. Toggle this switch on, now this debugging is on. We have to unlock the device first. So go down in this developer option, you can see this option. In my unlock status, my device is already unlocked. If your device is not unlocked, then go to this this account, my account. In the settings, you can see my accounts uh, just before Google. Then log in here with your ID and password. Then apply for uh, unlock option. Then your device will be ready for unlock and connect this device uh, to the PC. Now let's check to confirm this MI device is unlocked or not. This, this device is showing unlocked and we confirm with the PC. Now we need this MI fastboot unlock. For that one I download that that one from e, this site en.mia.com. It is downloaded already and I unzipped that one. So just uh, press here. It is always good to run as administrator. Good. This option, skip this one. Now, unlock is ready. Enter your already registered email ID and password if you have a my account. Otherwise, if you don't have a my account, you have to create one uh, by using your phone. Remember, the same user ID and password should be used here. Now, this device is in fast boot mode and it is connected to the PC. Now, next step is to flash this TWRP recovery for this Redmi 5 Plus CMD. Then, ensure the device is properly connected. For, for that one, type fast boot devices. Then, you can see the model number there, number of the device. Now, next step is type fast boot flash recovery then space then drag this image file directly now you can see the flashing message is flashing message it is done next step is to flash the device into twrp recovery for that one just type here fast boot boot space then again drag this image recovery image then now, the device will be booted up in TWRP mode. It is booted. Just swipe here to allow modifications. Remove this cable. Now, next step is wipe. Because we were using Android old version now we are going to flash Android 13 for that one it is very necessary to format all the data you will lose all your data in your phone now I have done this format data now go back again then give another wipe factory reset now next 
next step is to flash the ROM zip. So we have two options. Either you can keep that zip file in your PC and connect this device to the PC and transfer the file to the internal storage of this device. Now I am using the second method. I am using this pen drive. It is here. The file is here. So click on mount, then USB, then select storage, USB. Okay. Go back, install. Go to the file. Go to the folder where you have kept the file. Now my file name. I am going to flash this Pixel Recovery Plus Android 13. The apps are included in this one. It is not a vanilla ROM. So all the apps, Google apps will be there after flashing. So swipe to confirm flash. Now let's wait until the flashing is done. Now the flashing is completed. You can see done message there. Swipe to unlock the boot system. Now we can remove the pen drive. Now let's wait for a few minutes. You can see the device status, it is unlocked. Let's wait till the booting is done. Now it is come, now the booting is completed. Now select your language and everything. Set up the device now. Now the device is now booted up in Pixel Android 13. Let's check. So go to settings. You can see this is Android, the Android version here. This is Pixel Experience and Wins 13, Android 13. And there are some few customizations there, privacy, you can see.